Officials in Ukraine said the death toll from flooding following the destruction of the Kohovka Dam has risen to 16, and Russian officials said 29 people have died in territories that Moscow controls. The breaching of the Kohovka Dam on June 6 unleashed floodwaters across a large area of land in southern Ukraine and in Russian-occupied parts of Ukraine, destroying farmland and cutting off supplies to civilians. More than 3,600 people have been evacuated from the flooded areas in the Kherson and Mykolaiv regions, while 31 people were still missing and some 1,300 houses remained flooded. That's according to Ukraine's Interior Ministry. Here in Holopristan, a city in Russian-controlled Ukraine, volunteers were seen pumping flood water out of homes on Saturday. This woman says her only hope is God. We don't put our hopes in any of the authorities, she says. Ukraine accuses Russia of blowing up the Soviet-era dam under Russian control since early days of its invasion in 2022. A team of international legal experts assisting Ukraine's prosecutors in their investigation said in preliminary findings on Friday it was highly likely the collapse in Ukraine's Kherson region was caused by explosives planted by Russians. The Kremlin accuses Kyiv of sabotaging the hydroelectric dam, which held a reservoir the size of the US Great Salt Lake, to cut off a key source of water for Crimea and distract attention from a quote faltering counteroffensive against Russian forces.